Thomas Markle Jr., 51, of Grants Pass, Oregon has slammed Prince Harry's claim that the royals are the family Meghan never had. Meghan's half-brother told DailyMail.com, obviously, she had a family. She was very privileged she got everything she ever wanted. Harry made the statement on the BBC on Wednesday when he dished about the couple's Christmas holiday together in Sandringham, Norfolk. His comments, however, sparked controversy causing members of Markle's family to speak out, including her estranged half-sister Samantha Markle. Markle Jair added that Harry's comments were sure to upset their father, Thomas, 73, who he says made sure she had what she needed to be successful. Meghan Markle's father has been left extremely hurt after Prince Harry claimed the royals are like the family she never had, her brother has told DailyMail.com. Thomas Markle Jr., 51, of Grants Pass, Oregon, said the actress has a family who had smothered her with love and made a point of celebrating every holiday together. Their father, Thomas, is deeply hurt by the prince's remarks, Markle Jr. said. The prince has still to meet his fiancée's father, who lives in Mexico, although he has met her mother, Doria Ragland, who lives in Los Angeles. The couple divorced when Meghan Markle was six. On Wednesday, Harry, 33, told the BBC that former Suits star Meghan, 36, had enjoyed a fantastic Christmas at Sandringham in Norfolk, England, and said the royal family loved having her there. He added, I think we've got one of the biggest families that I know of, and every family is complex as well. Scroll down for video she's done an absolutely amazing job. She's getting in there and it's the family I suppose that she's never had. But Thomas Jr., speaking at his home in Oregon, told DailyMail.com that Harry's incendiary charge was far from the truth. She's had a really good family, he said. We were as close as we could be, as tight as we could be, that's what we were. We'd get together on Christmases, on holidays, on birthdays, on Thanksgivings. It was always somewhere, even though we lived in different parts of the city Los Angeles we still all got together. Obviously, she had a family she was very privileged. She got everything she ever wanted we did the best that we could in terms of getting together for holidays and whatnot. Of their father, retired lighting director Thomas Markle Sr., 73, he added, my father will be extremely hurt, actually. He dedicated the majority of all his time and everything to her. He made sure she had what she needed to be successful and get to where she's at today. Thomas Jr.'s comments echo those made by his estranged sister Samantha Grant, 53, of Ocala, Florida, who said on Wednesday that Meghan has a large family who are always there with her. Writing on, she continued, Our household was very normal and when Dad and Doria divorced, we all made it so it was like she had two houses. No one was estranged, she was just too busy. Meg's family, our family, Sick is complete with sister, brother, aunts, uncles, cousins, and the glue of our family, our amazing completely self-sacrificing father. She always had this family marrying merrily extends it. 
She has a large family she always did our dad is amazing and completely self-sacrificing. We made it so that she had two houses how fun it was. Meghan, whose engagement to Prince Harry was announced at the end of November, has spent most of the past month in London. The couple made several public appearances together following the announcement, including a trip to Nottingham and a visit to Buckingham Palace for the Queen's annual pre-Christmas party. Along with the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and the Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall, guests included Princesses Beatrice and Eugenie and Princess Michael of Kent. In a break with tradition, Meghan went on to SPE, 